Greedy gold diggers. They believe forced labor and turn around, you know, forcing you to pay your debt to them. So basically, greedy gold diggers who have enslaved, enslaved us have control of our souls. It's like every signature that you sign for that visa, every signature that you sign from the bank, every signature that you sign from your taxes, every signature of everything that you do in life is a signature. And they believe that's freedom. They believe that being a debt slave is freedom. You know, so imagine, you know, you know why they force to put you in labor the day you were born. I mean, the day you were born, you were born a slave. So they gave you a number, you know, your social security number, especially in this world. And then they gave you an ID card. So they have identity you know, so they give you this identity. So their paranoia of not trusting you. And they call that freedom. You know, having having identity, having a number. So you're treated just like a prisoner. You know, if you break the law, then you go to another prison. You know, then you have to then you have to labor yourself in that prison for way below the minimum wage. You know, that's what prisons Prison is designed for to make you labor on what you what you are. So they, they created criminality, you know. Greedy gold diggers, you know, their version of freedom is to to put you in debt. And then turn around, you know, you are contracted. Your soul is contracted to to your debt, you know, because that's why you that's why you sign everything in this world. And they call that positivity. They call that positivity in this world. So yeah, these fuckers who are fighting for their so-called freedom. You know, the freedom to enslave you. You know, yeah, it's like, you know, you have to work your ass off. You have to burn yourself out for these fuckers. These cold-hearted, heartless, gutless fuckers that they are they are cold-hearted heartless fuckers because they can they have the power to fire you they have the power to fire you if you fuck up so that tells you exactly how they are and and what they are and you talk about morality about about their mor their so-called morality of 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 having uh, living a life like this as a slave you know because you are enslaved by money Money has enslaved you in every aspects of every part of your life till the day you die, you know, because they, they want you to pay to die. They want you to make sure you pay when you die, you know, because that's the whole I that's their version of what freedom. This is this is how sick and twisted they are in this world. You know, that's why they call it divide and conquer. You know, divide and conquer is money itself. It's classism. You know, it's classism, and that's a, and they have to control the poor people. And see, the poor people, they have to make them really stupid. I mean, you have to be, you, the poor people have to be really, really stupid, you know, th so they had to pay. You know, everything that we do in life, we had to pay, you know. It's like, it's like you come into life, why, why are you coming into life and you had to pay to live? That's a question I have to ask. The ones who say that they're positive in this world, you know, the ones who believe that they are positive, they think they think this is a positive reality. In reality, it's survival of the fittest with money. It's survival of the fittest with money, and they call that freedom. You know, the ignorance and stupidity of not trusting ourselves. Actually, that's what the world is designed for: is not to trust ourselves, because we're all created enemies. We become enemies in the politics. Everything that's related to money, we become an enemy. You know, that's exactly how they design the world like this, is to make us all enemies of our own self and our own greed. And, it, and, and then, then turn around, they use karma. You know, they use karma to backfire on us based on their greed, based on our money. You know, this shows you how, how really 
Truly, they're not positive people in this world. They will not take care of you. Greedy people will never take care of you. I'm going to tell you, greedy people will never take care of you. Government's not going to take care of you. Corporation's not going to take care of you. Money certainly is not going to take care of you. It's just, we're being, you know, our planet is being terrorized. You know, our planet is being terrorized by by these these greedy gold diggers who really have no conscience for nobody. They really don't have a conscience. You can see that. You can watch. You can watch the way they talk and how they talk. There's no. There's. There's nothing but a cold-hearted, heartless person behind, it because of the influence of this world that's that's created us to divide and conquer. You know, because that's the way it, the way this world's designed. You know, they they just want to keep us stupid and dumb. You know, and believe in their ways of life. You know, they don't want. They don't want. To, they don't want. To, they don't want any other ways of life. So they'll call you communist. You know, that's the whole idea. Of what a greedy gold digger does. You, they'll call you communist because they don't. They don't believe that everything should be for free. You know, it shows you exactly how they are and how selfish they really are. They're not. They, their society is only for service to themselves. That's what their society is 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 service to themselves and that's the only thing they care about is service to themselves everybody else get fucked because that's the whole idea of this world is, is to fuck everybody and you know and everybody is the enemy because because money has created us to make us all enemies in this world we can't even work together in this world because we we, we always ask what's in it for me you know what's in it for me the bullshitters that they are the bullshitters that they will always be. They're nothing but lying, cheating, con men that wants to empower, overpower you and, and put you under a contract, you know, for your life. And then they call that freedom. Have a nice fucking day.